It's one of the busiest days of the year for florists. Shops all over the Hudson Valley are going to be packed with people looking for last-minute gifts. But if you think that's crazy, you have no idea what goes on behind the scenes the night before. There's a lot of effort going on today. It's about 50 hours at least to get everything done. So there's going to be a couple thousand roses sold today, at least. And then other mixed flowers, you know, fresh blooms to go with it. There's going to be over 100 deliveries. But what's the best part of making these beautiful bouquets for people? Seeing the reactions, of course. So off we go to deliver them. The funny thing is, is that, you know, delivering early in the morning, some people are very arrogant. You know, they'll answer the, you know, who is it? Uh, delivery. <laughs> And of course, I love to kid them, you know, just say delivery, not flowers. So they get to the door and they're really like, and they open the door and there's a beautiful display of flowers. And they all smile and I might get a tip. <laughs> house after house, the reactions are of sheer joy and appreciation of the love felt. To my son, it may be send a flower, I think. Does he do it every year? Every year he do that. Very sweet the boy. <laughs> Very sweet the son there. Yeah. Sometimes these arrangements truly are a surprise. Oh, from her son. Oh, isn't that sweet? I have a great brother that did this from my mom. She's not feeling well lately. These smiles may last all the way until next Valentine's Day. In West Harrison, Emily Young, Fios, One News.